Okay, we're with Katie Pyle, product line manager for Trail, and boy, she's been hard at work. What do we got, Katie? <laughs> All right, Sam, so, so today we are gonna talk about the Peregrine 12. Big update for the Peregrine. Peregrines are, you know, workhorse of the Saucony Trail franchise, um, the trail line. And here the big update, the big story is the weight. Is the weight. Um, so we've dropped, uh, current Peregrine is about 10.8 ounces. Here we're coming in right around 9.6, 9.7. So significant weight drop. Um, one of our lightest peregrines yet. The great news here is we don't sacrifice anything. So we're we're still going with our full length power track outsole. We have our grippy five millimeter lugs, and of course our rock guard for extra added uh, flexible protection. We'll have our power run midsole, so nice and responsive, really sleek. Um, you get a little bit of that, you know, close to ground, nimble, agile feel. Uh, four millimeter drop, so no change there. And we're also looking, we took our top sole out and we upgraded with this Power Run Plus soft liner. So you're gonna get that yeah. nice, uh, plush, cushioned underfoot feel. Excellent. And is the Power Run the same or has that been changed? It's the same formula. Yeah. It's the same formula. Um, so again, not not much changing in the in terms of the stack, in yeah. terms of the in terms of the formula itself. Okay. Um, and then the upper, the big story here, you know, nice and deconstructed, but you still get that protection that you know and love from the, from the Saucony wow, um, Peregrine. Wow, that's going to be our speedster. That's it. Yeah. Shoe. Thank you. Of what course. do you got? Well, you must have something else. Oh gosh, do I ever? Boy, does Saucony have stuff. <laughs> 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 that's okay. Too hot to handle. Oh, th this one really, really. Look. Wow, ooh, what's that? All right, so this is the Exodus Ultra. So this is the update to our um, franchise model in the Exodus. We really pivoted the shoe here um, to really focus on that ultra, that long distance trail runner. Um, so traditionally the Exodus has kind of been our ultra cushion, ultra kind of tank of the trail, if you will. Here we um, looked, the current one's about 11.8 ounces. Here this updates and we're looking at about 10.4 ounces. So Whoa. again, another significant, significant weight drop here. Um, if we start with the outsole, we have um, instead of a five millimeter lug that we've traditionally had on this shoe, we went to a four and a half. So just a little bit more versatility 20, there. Yeah. We also have our uh, uh, rock guard in the forefoot and our full length power track outsole. So great, excellent traction and grip. Beautiful looking outsole. Now the, the real the real fun here is in the construction of this shoe, which you can't see from the outside, but in the midsole, we'll have a, a thick layer of our Power Run PB foam. So our ultra cushioned, our top of the line premium uh, foam compound. And then with a protective core or rim, excuse me, of our Power Run foam. So you're getting all of that extra stability as long and not losing any of the cushion for long distance miles. Wow. Similarly here, we have our um, Power Run Plus sock liner. So you're gonna have that extra cushion, that extra great feel. Yeah, nope. oh yeah, there we go, yeah. And then we'll here we'll also introduce our um, distance last. So a lot of our uh, Saucony product of the years has been a four millimeter drop. And okay. here, here we go with a six millimeter uh, okay. offset. So um, that's a good height. Great, yeah, exactly, exactly. Especially for longer yep. distances. So you'll get a little more room in the forefoot, a nice secure midfoot with a debris shield on top. And then again, a nice snug uh, fit in the heel. Excellent, but you got one more, I We've think. We've got one well, more this, safe. Oh, the and best got, for last oh, year. Oh, look, wait a minute. Everything's color coordinated here. The booth, <laughs> look everybody. It's all, and what's this color? So this is our prospect color. So okay. this is our lead color for the season. Okay. Uh, nice and pink, really exciting. Unisex colorway here. And this is our all new endorphin edge. So for us at Saucony, we wanted to create a really compelling uh, carbon plated experience for the trail runner. So here we use, um, if we're talking about the carbon plate, we've teamed up with uh, our friends over at Carbitex to create a, a wonderful and dynamic uh, uh, carbon plate for the trail. So it's flexible in one direction and it's stiff in the other. And this so is really- So it flexes up with your toes, correct, but not the other way. Not the other way. Yeah, yeah. Why is that beneficial? So when you're running uphill, you get that nice propulsive feel. Yeah. It also creates like a shelf in your heel so that that heel is not gonna, that foot's not gonna bend backwards. Okay. So that over long distances, you're gonna have, you know, take less uh, yeah. pressure off your calves, off your quads, etc. And then conversely, when you're running downhill, you get a little more of that flex because yep. it's flexing in that direction. 
control over trains um, and a little more adaptability. What's the shape of the plate? Great question. So the shape of the plate is actually going to be a, a picture a wishbone shape. Yeah. So a bifurcated plate. And it starts. It starts about here. So yeah. Oh, a, that's good. You're yeah. You're going to get back. a lot of flexibility there. Yeah. And almost think about a rally car, if you yeah. will, like a, a, a little bit of adaptability on each yeah. side. Great for trail running. The plate will come to about here. Yeah. So um, really the, the idea with that is uh, we don't want that heel over time to be constantly hitting a stiff plate. Yeah. So we really want that runner to be able to hit and land on our Power Run PV foam, yeah. our ultimate uh, premium foam. And again, gives you a little more adaptability upon impact. And we got, do we have rock protection too? We do, that's a that, good yeah. point. So yeah. we have full length yeah. rock protection here. Protecting full length. Full length, yep. Yeah. And that's going to protect us from, protect the foam in general, but also protect um, some, or help with point loading. So protect our foot wow. from roots and rocks. And what about the weight here? So the weight's the big story. So coming in at about nine ounces uh, for a men's nine. So super lightweight, uh, really, really minimal package. And the package. stack, it's big. The stack is big. We're talking 35, 29, six wow. millimeter offset, plenty of cushion underfoot. And again, working really nicely hand in hand with that flexible carbon fiber plate. It's going to be tough to decide. <laughs> <laughs> The, the Ultra, the Exodus Ultra, or the Edge? We've got a lot of good options. So what would you, what, how would you distinguish the two, just to finish, like the choices? Well, how, what were you thinking? Absolutely. So race day, I mean, you're yep. going fast, you're cruising on the yep. mountains, you want to be nimble and quick. Long distance, this is going to be your okay. sort of go-to distance, ultra distance yep. shoe. And then finally, if we're talking about the Peregrine, yes. this is going to be your everyday workhorse, yep. your lightweight, nimble. Um, Sloppy terrain. You got it. Yeah. You got it. Extra traction. Yep. We're, this is this is our workhorse here. Thank you, Katie. You Much it, appreciated. Sam. Anytime.